Hi guys. So today I'm recapping Wrapped Up in Christmas, Heather and Ryan's love story. The movie begins with Heather, a hardworking mall manager on her way to work. She attends a meeting at work and her boss tells her with making the tough decision of canceling the leases of underperforming stores in the mall during the Christmas holiday. If successful, she will get promoted to vice president of operations. Heather has totally put her data life on hold and just wants to focus on getting the promotion. Then she meets Ryan at the hot chocolate stand at the Christmas tree lot and they both order Mexican hot chocolate. Ryan is a non-practicing lawyer and aspiring painter who is helping out his aunt at her toy store at the mall. Then she and Ryan bump into each other again. This time he spills hot coffee all over her. Even though he calls her pretty, she doesn't seem interested in him. But her niece has other plans and asks this mall Santa who Ryan happens to be playing for a friend at the time to bring her aunt a boyfriend for Christmas. Her niece gives him a few tips on the things her aunt Heather likes, like her favorite book and the type of boyfriend she would like. The next day, Ryan goes over to the cookie shop where Heather is after picking up her favorite book a Christmas Carol at the bookstore and he pretends to know about the book to impress her. Then Ryan finally asks her on a dinner date that night. They go for dinner and Heather enjoyed her date. The next day Ryan takes her flowers. He asks her out to eat but she's a bit busy so he ends up coloring with her niece. Heather gets back and Ryan asks her on a surprise date later that night. They go on the date and Ryan serves her Mexican hot chocolate from a thermos. They listen to Christmas carolers, then they share a kiss. The next day, Ryan's aunt gets a letter from Heather canceling her lease. Later, Heather bumps into Ryan at his aunt's store. Ryan introduces his aunt and invites her to dinner at his place. Heather now realizes that Ryan's aunt is one of the store owners on the list of leases she cancelled. She is now freaking out that he is going to break up with her once he finds out. Then Heather goes by Ryan for dinner hoping to tell him the truth but she didn't get a chance to. Ryan burnt the food. They talk about their, them being menaces in the kitchen. Then he shows her his paint room and she finds a painting of her in her red coat at the tree lot where they first met. He tells her she can have it. The next day Ryan finds out that the letter his aunt received is from Heather. He texts Heather to meet him, then his friend asks him to cover as the mall Santa. He forgets to put on his Santa beard and he bumps into Heather who is wondering why he he's dressed as Santa. Then Ryan confronts Heather about cancelling his aunt's lease. Then Heather figures out that Ryan was Santa at the time her niece asked Santa for a boyfriend for her. So they are both upset with each other and Heather leaves. Then Heather boss, Heather's boss calls her to give her the promotion after her presentation, which helps to save Ryan's aunt sore. The promotion, however, means she has to move to Seattle, Washington. After some thought, Heather turns on the promotion to go to Seattle, Washington, but she ends up getting the vice president position at her current location. Ryan learns that Heather helped to reinstate his aunt's store. 
then Heather's niece devises a plan with Ryan and she gets Heather to the mall on Christmas Day where Ryan surprises her with snowfall Christmas magic to lift her Christmas spirit. Then they share a magical kiss. The end. If you enjoyed this movie recap, you can find more somewhere here. Okay, bye guys.